I've thought about this for the past two years, ever since this movie came out. Thinking about this director's track record with making movies, and the way he's spoken about Toy Story 4, I don't earnestly believe that this man is incompetent. I don't. I honestly, truly don't. I believe this movie was nothing but a malicious attack on everything the original trilogy established. This is the end of the line. And it's all your fault. You ruined this. You've destroyed it all. And you did it all with a crooked smile on your face that looks like it belongs in a villain of your company's own making. He has absolutely no respect for this franchise, and as a result, I have absolutely no respect for this director after what he's done. He may claim to love Toy Story. I love Toy Story. I saw the first two before I started working here at Pixar, and so to be asked to direct this movie was such a huge honor and terrifying because I didn't want to mess it up. But actions speak louder than words. It doesn't matter if I say I love something if I'm simultaneously plunging a knife into that same thing. Because in case it's not clear, he doesn't believe he's done anything wrong. But Josh Cooley believes that what he did to these characters was in the best interests of everyone. And that massive ego was only further inflated when they handed him that shiny trophy. So he'll coast through the rest of his life by resting on his laurels with an unshakable belief that destroying beloved characters leads you to great success. And judging by the audience's reaction to this garbage, there's nobody else in the world that will ever try to convince him otherwise. So take your Looney Tunes ripoffs, Evil Knievel failures, and neurotic spork with you as you go right off into your next project that puts another massive paycheck in your pocket, and go fuck yourself to infinity and beyond.